Hi, I'm LP Master Six. Oh, yes I am. And I took a short break so my commentary would get better, so I didn't get all dry and gross. Like a, like a dry cooch, you know. I felt one dry cooch once. And it was only dry once. And <clears throat> I ate some Pringles, lightly salted, because I've got terrible sodium levels. And just for the small variety of food I eat and the lack of healthy foods that I eat, I have almost all my nutrients required. Or I've got at least, like, not 100% of what you're supposed to have for the day, but like a good bit. So I don't really have any deficiencies. I've just got an overload of sodium because I eat so much shitty, salty food. So I eat the lightly salted Pringles, which have half the sodium, but they still can't legally be considered a low sodium food. Oh, I want to do this, and I'm doing it. Okay, well we just knocked that level out in one minute. <laughs> and uh oh, we're down to crown exclamation point. Can we do this? Yes, because I practice level 8 all the time. So it's really a lot easier than it should be. I'm just getting funky with it now. I'm revitalized. But here it... Oh, that's a poison mushroom. I knew it. And look, every time there's a poison mushroom, they always make it bounce back. Okay, this one you don't want momentum. Because you want to do that. I mean, you could do it a different way, but I don't. I find it safer. Now, this is sort of a maze. It's not technically a maze, but if you go to the end of the level, it will wrap around. See this fucking hammer going chasing me. So you have to take that vine by jumping on the Koopa. But you can loop around and around as many times as you want, because it takes you through a coin room. But I'm not doing it, because I know the path. Look at my score. Oh, that's crazy good. Well, isn't that a slogan for something? Now that I think about it, it's gotta be. Ah, oh, you know where I wanna go? Logan's. They've got the best and most easily accessible peanuts there are. Uh, maybe not the best of peanuts, but it's a fun place to eat peanuts. You gotta give it that. Uh, those brick blocks, I mean, th those blocks I'm standing on, those are brick blocks disguised into the background and here's the one you want this is supposed to be actually a trap because you're supposed to jump on the koopas but you can make the jump without it and oh shit what do we do and we gotta jump on the blocks i just wanted to reveal them to make it easier luigi can clear this jump with relative ease part of the reason why he's easier oh stop doing that mario all right Oh, not enough momentum. I got you. Got to run across both of these. Oh, stop! I ooh. Then you gotta let this go. Make it, make it. Yes. Oh, we're at the final level. Is this really only gonna be like ten minutes? <laughs> yeah, I'm so excited. I'm so excited. Oh, crown? No, that sounded like a question mark. Crown? No, that sounded confused. I just gotta yell crown, and that would work. That's so stupid. Uh, okay, so I made the hard part with Super Mario, but not the easy part. Welcome to Bowser's Castle. Mm, uh, don't sing to that, I was just mumbling. See, that jump, that first jump, because you gotta go down, you can't, like, to the left of the start. But that's really hard to pull off if you have a power-up. This is another improvement over the original Super Mario Brothers. They don't make it look like underwater, but they still do enough at the same time. By playing the music, by having the bubbles everywhere, the miscoloration of the fire bars, I like it. Oh, it's another pipe maze just like the original Bowser's Castle. I just know this one better than I know the original Bowser's Castle. I get. I, I don't even think I've played this one more. Maybe I've played this like the same amount that I've played Super Mario Brothers. That's scary. I don't think anybody in the world can say that. Okay, somebody's got to be able to say that. I might be the only person in existence who likes this game better. I'm crazy. I'm a crazy guy. Okay. Mm. Mm. 
about to wipe sweat off my brow. I don't sweat. I don't know if that was this golf let's play, but the best comment I've ever gotten on YouTube whatsoever is either this golf let's play or my previous golf part one where I talked about how I don't ever sweat. That's fine. Do your shit because you can get a fire flower here, but oh well. Oh, there is one more enemy in the game. Oh, I didn't mention that Bowser imposters, by the way, they used to be called Bowser imposters. I had it backwards. Now they're called false Bowsers instead of Bowser. Oh, the fire was invisible. That's blue Bowser. That's not a false Bowser. He used to be believed to be a... Because if you shoot him with fireballs, he dies as Bowser. He's not a fake. He used to be believed to be Bowser's brother or something. Like Nintendo Power or some something else said that. Something official said that, and I thought that was pretty cool. But he's not a... But in... He, that was kind of retconned where he was a false Bowser, like a special type. And we saved a door. We beat the game, by the way. Holy shit. I beat Super Mario Brothers the Lost Levels. Pieces paved with kingdoms saved. Hurrah to Mario, our only hero. This intro trip of a long friendship. That shit was not friendship. Look at that. Oh, you get 100,000 points for each life you have left because they know it's bullshit. Peach has a new sprite, obviously. I don't like it as good as the original, but here's the only new song. I said in Super Mario Bros. Koji Kondo wanted it to be longer. The ending theme, he wanted it to be AABA format. And they made it have AABA format. However, we are going to miss out on a cutscene. Possibly. I don't know. But uh, I've already told you my thoughts on the game. Uh, I'll tell you my next Let's Play in a minute. This is the only game, or this is the only full song in the game that ends. See? It ended. Thank you, Mario. We present Fantasy World. Let's try Nine World with one game. World Nine? That is what you get if you play the game Warpless and beat World 8-4. However, I pause to explain something. There's a little cutscene where faceless toads surround Peach and colors flash a little bit after your lives tally up, but I had too many lives from the glitch, so we didn't get to see it. So you guys can see it on your own or go look it up. Welcome to World 9. You only have one life to do this. This was directly inspired from the Minus World glitch and the 256 level glitch that I explained in Super Mario Brothers. You can't do this. Uh, bullet Bills, I don't think they even work underwater, but oh, they just wanted it to be a nice little fantasy world, and it is. This is my favorite world in the game, by far. World 9. <laughs> Look, the Lakitu underwater. Brilliant. And he can't do shit to you. You, I have died to him, or, yeah, I died to him once. Oh my god, no. Please. No. I, I'm going to have to beat the game all over again now. Oh, no, I'm not. Okay. Whoo! Like, all 32 levels worthless to do these last four. This is the only time a flagpole is underwater. Look at these funky graphics. See, did I fake you out? I'm not telling you my next Let's Play yet, because the game's not over. Ha 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 Yeah, it's me. Oh, no, this is the one I died to. No, no, no! Okay. I'll see you after I beat the entire game again. Oh, oh, there it is. Here's the cutscene. Oh, I'm glad I filmed. Wait, what? Okay, it stops. <laughs> well, I played as Luigi that time, and I'll meet you back at 9 2. Okay, well, I'm back. Ah, uh, that only took me about an hour-ish, and oh, that lag to better not screw me over again. Oh, I swear to God. But, uh, yeah, Luigi, I honestly couldn't tell if that run was harder or not. Because, uh, I'm more used to Mario, and I was rushing a little bit, because I didn't want to play through all 32 levels twice in a row. Now, who wants to do that? But look at these cool coins, and, and yes, this is the same sitting. 
I just sat here, did the entire thing again. Now I'm gonna make you want to rewind. Go watch Luigi's legs flap in the water as he even grabs the flagpole at the bottom. <clears throat> A castle level? That's what the music says. That's what the graphics kind of say. Is it a maze? Oh, what is it? What's that spring's use? Where does this go? There's no warps in World 9. There's no worlds after World 9 to warp to. <clears throat> Welcome to um, this. So, uh, World 9's um, hopefully what inspired Super Mario Maker, because look at this. This is weird. And I love it. Oh, and this starts you back at the beginning, and don't go in that. That's lava. In case you can't tell, you can't make that jump all the way over that pipe. What's this pipe do? And it takes you to the invisible, or not the invisible, the vine's invisible, but it takes you to the coin heaven! So I guess you could grind for lives here. <clears throat> but that would take a good while to get up to 100 coins. Okay, let's try, we keep going. <clears throat> Uh, did I mention how this game's not canon because the Japanese manual Oh no, it's Blue Bowser. Blue Bowser, no. No, not Blue Bowser, he's back. Not Blue Bowser, Blue Bowser's back. Oh, Jesus. Actually, I'm kind of scared. I'm going to be very, very cautious. Please, get out of the way. Oh, Blue Bowser, I swear to God. Ooh, we're about to have some problems, Blue Bowser. Oh, oh, oh my god, I'm not doing all those 32 levels over again. That was hell. And that was all of 9-3. Just Blue Bowser and a coin heaven. Oh. <laughs> and it's underwater again. This is the final level of World 9. It's just a barrage of enemies. It in Jap- I suddenly know Japanese! It says... Oh shit, wait. I think it says thank you. Hold on. Oh, get out of the way. Blooper. Okay, I'm gonna stand here and spawn- re unspawn the blooper. No, go away. Stop. Okay, I need to stop following it so it'll go away. It's ruining the final thank you. It either, yeah, it totally says thank you. I thought it said you are a super player, but no, it's thank you. Ha! I can't believe it. Oh, I did it. And it loops you back around so you can grind for lives and do whatever you want, but... <clears throat> I'm just gonna kill myself. Wait, did I get an extra life? I did! I didn't even know you actually could. I assumed you could, but no, it takes away all your lives at the end of 8-4. I like the challenge. I mean, it's not really a challenge. There's only two things that could kill you. Game over. You're a super player. We we'll hope you will see you again, Mario and staff. Oh, doesn't that feel good? <laughs> well... Oh, and as you know, by the way, oh, now I have 10 stars. I like that instead of 9 because I hate the number 9. I hate all its constituents. So I like 10 stars. That is 10, right? has to be. Well, you know, uh, I might as well tell you one last tidbit of information before we head off to the next Let's Play. <laughs> See, the A plus start trick doesn't work anymore, as I said. So what is that code now? There's four more worlds! Worlds A through D. And I'll see you next time for them. <laughs> Woo -hoo -hoo. But you have to have eight stars to access this.